hope you guys have been good it is a new week it's a monday um wait let me do the intro first if you are new here if you're new to this channel uh thank you for stopping by please don't forget to press the subscribe button and if you're returning sabi welcome back so it's a new week um i've just dropped tiama off at school i am on my way to work and um yeah I'm, I'm manifesting positive vibes this week you know good things only so um yeah we'll see what we get up to this week uh but for now let me be off to work i am running late but what else is new <laughs> but yeah, i'll check you guys a little bit later on my nephew by the way 
<laughs> He's always so happy to see me. Shame. That's so sweet of him. Where the wheels of this car were just not made right. Yo, it's gonna bother me. It's gonna bother me. It's just gonna bother me. Hey guys, <clears throat> so I just got back home. Um, well, I didn't get back home now, but um, I just got back home from my mom's um from my mom's place it is 210 yeah it is it is 210 and um <clears throat> i'm preparing um lunch for tomorrow for tiamo um actually for everyone I'm preparing lunch for tomorrow and I, <clears throat> I'm so tired um, I was gonna do it in the morning but I know how I am um, there's a very high chance I'll be running late and if I leave it for the morning then hey. Then there's a high chance everything will just go wrong in the morning so i'll rather just do it now so that i know it's over and done with so um yeah so i'm doing lunch for tomorrow and um i was planning on doing a grocery haul for you guys um but yeah i i couldn't when i got home i had to go to my mom's and i stayed longer than i anticipated to <clears throat> so I was unable to do the grocery haul for you guys um, but yeah yo guys I'm tired like, I literally feel my body just wanna crash so I'll check to you guys tomorrow <laughs> guys guys like let me tell you you know when you walk into a salon and you walk out and you got cat eyes girl you know it's on you know that tonight it's not gonna be that night it's it's on like you're at it's going down tonight it is going to be going down so tonight and the rest of the nights the next coming three four nights i'm gonna be suffering for beauty that's what's gonna be going down so you'll see you almost through my life don't stay calling me you'll continue to try to play these games
be That's why you think I left but what a time Got tired of your shit, you almost threw my mind Long stay on the bed Talking to me to try to play these games Leave your family in the door of And I don't think you'll ever change your way Cause I have, it's not a home with no So <clears throat> it's been it's been a couple of days or a few days since um I last recorded. Um yeah, so lately, you know, I've I've yeah, my mind or or yeah, my mind has just been flooded or heavy with um decisions that i needed to make and um it's funny because this the past couple of days i was um a couple of days ago i was um looking or watching um case of log and at some point sorry guys um at some point she's touched on you know spirituality and having faith and um having god do things in his own timing and in his own way and stuff like that oh shit um and and um yeah so that's what she was saying and um so i started following also <clears throat> on instagram they call, they call it <coughs> oops sorry guys wisdom and wellness um it's done by Mpumile Duaba. she's very she's also highly spiritual she's um high on faith and um she's high on faith and um lives by the word and all of that so these first couple of days you know that has sort of like been the type of contact has been content has been flooding my timeline like you know in the, in the videos and the content that i was consuming um faith and god and having relationship with god has been popping up um more frequently and um i found it it stood out because of the current situation i was in or i am in where um i needed to sit and make decisions but I'm struggling to make those decisions because I am being emotional um, in making those decisions. And I've, I'm finding it difficult to, to decide, pretty much. I know what I'm saying probably won't make sense because um, I'm being vague um, in the things that I'm saying. But yeah, like um, it's tough, you know, it's tough and it made me sort of realize and ask myself how um how my relationship is with with god um is my faith really strong and it made me question those things that you know and um, how close or far am i from him and you know how much how much faith do i really have in him and i i have been tested or there's been situations where i had to exercise my faith in him but i know i have failed to and you know, it, it, it rakes me. It does. Um, but yeah, it, I don't know if it's out of fear or I, I expect God to first show his hand, um, which he has. I mean, there's like quite a number of times I could tell you that he's come through for me. Um, but, it's, but I think in him doing that, I'm still, I'm still not exercising the faith that I should be or that he needs me to um I'm still trying to rely on my own knowledge or strength um to keep me going or to figure out solutions to certain situations or certain decisions that I need to make so yeah so I'm I'm right now I'm in that kind of space 
um where i feel like i need some help or some divine intervention where i feel like i just i just want to be closer to to god or i just want to feel some sort of comfort um and knowing that he's there and he's he's aware or conscious of of what i'm going through or the decisions that i need to make and um and usually when when i'm in this kind of space um whether it's motion emotionally or mentally um i go to i go to a particular place and i know you know a lot of people would pray and i i do pray guys i do but um there's a particular place that i choose to go to and this is where i feel like my prayers are heard not that they're not heard in my own private space at home or anywhere else but i think because my mind and and attention is solely on the prayer my thoughts are bait uh, on what i'm trying to say or what i'm praying about um it, i i feel like it, it's 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 reached his ears so i always come here to to just wrap my thoughts around him um have myself pour out my feelings and what i'm going through and i always feel comforted after i have done that um and i think it's because of the environment here and how peaceful it is and how harmonious this place is where i feel like you know what um a weight have been has been lifted off my shoulders and um I feel like I've got an in, in, the added strength that I need to just go on. So yeah, so I've I've, I've come here to just try and um, release some what do you call it anxiety to just feel at ease, just to find some sort of um, peace and calmness. Just maybe that will help me like clear my mind and um all the clutter that's you know that's in my thoughts and all of that stuff um so yeah i'm 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 gonna just go in but i also want to just to come and close the vlo the vlog um i think i'm gonna just end it here i don't want it to be too long but also um yeah i'm right now just in that space where i just want to just be in that moment of just um dealing with my thoughts and and my emotions so i'm gonna i'm gonna end this vlog here and i will most definitely see you guys in the next vlog thank you for staying tuned for watching up until this end um please don't forget to subscribe and um, i will see you guys on the next one peace